So guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video and I am here to show you, yes, he looks terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. This is the Ichthyornis. Now this just absolute creepy looking death monster is the bane of noobs existence. He also sits like really creepily on your shoulder, like half holding your neck, half holding your shoulder, like you're never quite sure what he's going to do. But uh, this is my Dino Day review series on him. So what is he good for? I happen to be in an area where I can show you what he's good for. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to set him on aggressive and throw him off your shoulder. Now he'll be on follow me right now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and turn him off to follow me. And you'll see he's on hunt and retrieve mode right now. We're going to go ahead and turn him on to hunting mode. Oops, not what I wanted. I'm going to make sure his behavior is set to aggressive. And what he'll do is he is going to go and dive into the water. He'll do his like little circle to figure out where he's going to get this thing from. And boom! What's really neat about this, he will never, just never stop this. But um, he'll just sit here and I can literally just log off right here. And he'll bring me fish over and over and over and over again. He'll even bring me compies, he'll bring me dodos, he'll bring me any small tame, and obviously that's quite useful. We're going to go ahead and whistle passive on him for right now, because I want to show you another cool thing you can do with this guy. Hold still for a second, buddy. We're going to put him on hunt now, and what he's going to do, we're going to say aggressive, and now he's going to go into the water, and he's just going to grab himself a load of fish. Now that happens to be a Pelagornis. Did you just steal my tranquilizer dart? You evil little turd. And he's actually going to kill it, I think. Ooh, there's an otter right there. So he can do this with small tames as well. He'll pick them up, do some damage to them. He obviously does a one-hit kill to a, um, a fish, no matter what size the fish is. Oops, I killed an otter. I feel bad now. And uh, is he not going to kill that thing? Oh, there he goes. So now he's going to eat that, as you can see right there. There it goes. And now he's going to go back to his little farm. So this guy, as long as you're near water, will continue to swim in the water, grab himself fish, eat them, and then when you decide to whistle him on stop follow, or stop being aggressive, he will stop eating the fish. But what's really awesome about this is as long as you are nearby some fish, this guy will just go to town. Like, this is nuts. Like, you can sit here and not have to worry about fishing for a long period of time because he'll just go in the water and pick you up some fishies. Now, he will do this unlimited time. So let's say you want to log off because you need some fish. Look at this. And now we're going to whistle passive on him. And I'll show you right now. He was on hunt mode, not hunt and retrieve. Look at this. You can sit here for days and just do this. I mean, obviously he didn't get a huge amount, but that's pretty crazy that he was able to get that decent amount of stuff. Where is he going? Oh, he's coming back to me now. Okay, cool. But the Ichthyornis can be set onto a mode, and he'll allow you to actually collect fish passively, which is nice. So you can just like pull up yourself a chair, set him on aggressive, and he will continue to gather things over and over and over, and you can come back with a, 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 a just a load of fish meat. Especially if you don't mind just like logging off for a little bit. Alright, kind of a cool little thing because these guys are just the bane of the Bob's existence. But other than that, kind of a fun little feature. Alright, teach out.